Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you guys are new. My name is Dink and I post Disney related content and all things Disney on this channel. Now today I'm so stinking excited. Like I'm so, so excited for today's video. But before I get into the topic of today's video, I just want to let you guys know that today's video is being filmed in the cinematic mode of my new iPhone 13 Pro. I just want to try it out, see how it looks and all of that. Um, definitely let me know in the comments like your feedback, if you like it, you hate it. Definitely let a girl know if you like it or not. Um, but I just wanted to try it out. Anyways, back to today's video. We are doing a Funko Pop haul. It's been quite some time since I've done a Funko Pop haul. Um, but if you guys didn't know this, I do collect Funko Pops. I did at one point go really, really extreme to where I was literally buying pops like almost every single day every single week um and i think it's been quite some time since i've purchased one i did get a new one um that's up there it is my dante one from box lunch it was a box lunch exclusive then i went to frankincense and like there's pop vendors like tents and stuff booths like everywhere so it was so hard like not to buy some and I saw a set that I've been wanting for quite some time um, since I saw pictures of it and I thought you had to pre-order to get it and this place had almost, I think it had all of them. Um, but yeah, uh, this haul is a chalice haul. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that store right. Um, they do have an actual store and then they have a booth at Frankincense. If you guys don't know what Frankincense is, is are you living under a rock it's like the best place for like collectors nerds and like people who love all things like funko pops Yu-Gi-Oh cards pokemon cards like all fandoms you will find at this place it's a big old warehouse and there's vendors and booths of things like it's crazy um it's a little intense because you literally want to buy everything but yeah um, I will link that information all down below as well as this Funko Pop stores information all in my descri description box in case you guys want to check it out and all that. Um, but let's get into it. So the pops that I'm going to be sharing with you guys are the Nightmare Before Christmas train set that they came out with. Like, I know, it's a train set and it all connects. You guys know how I feel about like pops that connect. It's insane, it's really cool, and it's like awesome to display. Um, I also am a out of the box collector mainly, but I do keep some of my pops in the box. Honestly, I think it's your collection. Do what you want with it, do what you will. It's yours to keep and just do what you want. So no hate here, um, but let's just get into it. So um, I think I'm gonna show you guys the biggest one first because it only makes sense, like the actual train. Um, let me get it for you guys. I will be taking them out of the box and I will be showing you guys how they all connect as well in this video. So this is the first like part of it and it is Jack Skellington here. Um, so stinking cute. So here is what it's gonna end up looking like. This is the whole series and it's a train with little carts of characters from Nightmare for Christmas. I think this idea is so cool and awesome and it does have like the pop trains here this one is zero seven and yeah first starting off the train is jack skellington and of course he is in the engine the train of the whole set it's a purple train and it has like orange tires so let's go ahead and take him out of the box and see what this guy looks like he's oh i love jack skellington like so much and i do decorate um christmas and halloween all night before christmas theme i just keep it all up during the holidays so <laughs> this will be hopefully in the background soon i think i'm gonna put it on this shelf but we will see oh my god look how cool he is so here is jack skellington he looks so happy in his little engine train and then the train is purple and you have these orange tires they do not move but i love that they're like different like sizes and shapes <laughs> and then here's the front of the train with we we have like a little spider web and yellow with the lights and then this is the other side of the train and it's so cool guys like it's so awesome here's the top of it as well and with these pops it's only half of their body so his body kind of like 
stops because it's in here so it's only the chest and like up <laughs> like his torso and up right torso it's your torso right uh, but he's so he's so precious and cute i absolutely love it and he just looks so stinking happy his head i think does move yeah you can move his head so there's that uh so adorable so next in this series i believe is sally i'm like reaching in my bag i should probably put the bag down it'd probably be easier <laughs> okay so next in this series is sally and she is in a cat cart so stinking cute and this number is zero eight so adorable so let's go ahead and take her out of the box as well i'm gonna have funko pops all over the ground and everything it's okay <laughs> so here's Sally. Look at how cute she is. And her little cat cart. This is absolutely adorable. And I love that her hair is blowing in the wind. Like, you know, she's on the train. And she's blowing. Like, that detail is really, really nice. So she's holding on to this little kitty cart. I think that's so cute. She's so happy. Oh my god so stinking adorable we love it and then it has like this little thing right here where it will connect to jack's piece and then it has a hole over on this side where it connects to the next character but oh, she's so stinking precious this one's so cute guys i love this one so much so there's sally and then next i believe is a geek buggy <laughs> I love this one so much. Oogie Boogie is so stinky cute. Like, the merch they make for him is so cute. And he's supposed to be, like, evil. And, like, he's the villain, you know? But it's, like, they make merch. And he's just so adorable. And I need to have it all. Um, So, next one is Oogie Boogie. And he is in his, his dice cart. So, here he is. Oh, my God. Sorry if there's, like, a glare. And his number is 09. So, we're going to take him out of the box. And take a closer look at it. Not actually drop the box, you know. I'm literally just throwing my boxes. <laughs> oh my god, this one's so sinking cute, guys. Like, so cute. Here he is. He's so happy. Like, so happy. He's, like, winking and everything. And this is him in, like, his brown color. You will find merch where he's in his brown color, like tan, beige, brown color. And then you'll find merch where he's in this green color. Let me know which one you guys like better. Do you like brown or do you like the green? Let me know. I go back and forth. Like, I like the brown, but then I like the green. So I go back and forth a lot. But this so stinking cute. Like, look at him and his dice. I kind of wish they put the snake eyes. Like, there's just the one and they should have put a one right here too. That would have been cool, but he just like, he's so happy. He could move his little head. But I just love how adorable and happy he is. And then here's the back side of the car. And then he has his wheels. That's what it looks like. He's so cute. And then here is his thing that will connect to Sally. And then the next one will connect here. But adorable, adorable. And then next, I believe, is Zero. Oh my god, here's <laughs> Zero. This is actually my first Zero Pop, my first Jack Pop, and Oogie Boogie. I only have like the miniature, you guys can't see in this background because like I'm using the cinematic mode. Um, but I only have like miniatures of like Night Before Christmas characters. The only actually like, big one I have is Sally, which I got for Christmas last year. So this set, obsessed. So here's Zero, he's in the little duck cart be so cute and then his number is 10 so we're gonna take him out of the box i love zero he's so stinking cute and i'm just dropping these boxes <laughs> here he is he's so adorable like how can you not how can you not so stinking cute right like he's so happy i'm literally gonna cry guys because my eyes look at my eyes are getting watery because he's just so stinking adorable adorable but here he is with the evil little ducky and everything and you have his pumpkin nose i just love how happy he looks in this little cart and then you have his ears and he's just like oh my god this one's so cute and probably want to be one of my favorites out of all of them 
but he is adorable and then his cart plaque like the bottom piece is gray whereas um sally's and oogie's is black but there is zero and then next we have Next we have the mayor, and the mayor is in, it says, in the ghost cart, which just makes sense to me, because technically he's in the vampire teddy cart, like, vampire teddy right here, love vampire teddy, literally my favorite little toy in the movie, but here he is, he's in the vampire teddy cart, it's not a ghost, it's a teddy, <laughs> evil little vampire teddy, but here he is, his number is 11, so let's go ahead and take him out as well. Right, literally Funko Pop boxes all on the ground around me. So here's the mayor, he looks happy as well. I think they all just look like happy and having a good little time on this train, but he's kind of like whistling it looks like, and then he has the blush cheeks. You have the vampire teddy card at the bottom, which is so adorable, we love. And then his card is like half black, half white which is really nice and he also has his other face when he's like freaking out and like oh my god which i love that they put both of the faces and it looks really nice i think it looks like the chase version of him like that pop version i'm not 100 percent sure but it's so cool and you can just like twist it whether he's having a great old time or like he's he's not having a good old time <laughs> but there it is it's so cool these are just so adorable i love these it's like a little cup <laughs> so those are all the ones i have unfortunately the one that i'm missing is the scary clown guy um i think he's called like the scary clown with the tear tear away face um but it just says clown and he's in a jack-in-the-box like cart I will insert picture here of it. I don't have this one um, because it's really expensive. Like out of all of them, he's like really expensive. He's the most expensive one out of this set. He it runs about like $35 to like $50, which is kind of insane to me. Like out of, literally out of all of them, really him? Why, why, why him? I just don't understand. Maybe because he's like the last piece that comes out connects all of them like he's uh what is it called the caboose the caboose of the train i think that's what it's called the caboose right that's the back of the train i could be wrong or pronouncing that wrong um but yeah i don't have him because he's expensive eventually of course i probably will cave or i'll put him on my christmas list hoping someone like buys him for me because yeah i don't why is he expensive i don't know let me know what you guys think of this set i think it's really cute um we're gonna go ahead and connect them all together so you guys can see and then eventually you guys are going to see them in my background the cute little train in my night before christmas background i think it's an adorable set and i love it so much if i can find all of them i'll link them down below but let's go ahead and connect all these funkos together it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it like i said it's been quite some time since i've done a funko haul for you guys let me know if you guys would like more in the future also let me know which little cart is your favorite i'm it's hard for me to decide i think it's between the oogie boogie one and the zero one they look just 
so stinking happy riding this adorable train but if you guys enjoyed today's video make sure you give this video a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you guys can be notified every time i upload a video which is every monday wednesday and saturday and i'll catch up with you guys next time bye dice cart i don't have i think i need lipstick all over my teeth <laughs> And then we take a pause, a little break, a little water.